All right, hello. Um, my name is Stephen Rust. I'm a principal architect at Akamai. I'm also the co-chair of the CNCF Tag Runtime. And I'm here today to talk to you about Tag Runtime. Uh, and before really I can get into that, I want to talk about what it is that a tag is, right? What is a technical advisory group? And the purpose of the tags are to really scale contributions from the community and across uh, the responsibilities within the CNCF. So if you talk about scale, you look at a lot of the projects in the landscape, you show the scary landscape photo, right? Uh, there's no way that an 11 person TOC can be domain experts in every single project and that's where the tags come in to scale the TOC and be able to provide uh, project guidance and domain expertise. So what does a tag really do? Um, and I think if you look at the last slide, what's really interesting is that every project in that landscape falls within one of the tags uh, scopes. And there are eight different tags today. And a project may fall within one or more of those uh, tags. And uh, again, it's about spreading the work uh, across multiple people and being able to advise uh, for projects and really help those projects as well. So these are the eight tags today. Uh, we have some nice logos. Uh, tag runtime's a little bigger on this screen because this is a runtime talk. And uh, if you look at what a tag is, is meant to do, right, it's really about helping those projects, reaching out, engaging with those communities. And it's often the first point of contact within, um, for a project within the CNCF. A tag will provide what we're calling a domain technical review. And uh, this is uh, really a, an effort to standardize feedback from the tags uh, so that uh, our feedback is consistent uh, and is often used for things like if a project's moving from sandbox to incubation or graduation, um, provide feedback to the TUC about that. Uh, we also write uh, white papers as uh, there's interest or needs, things like reference architectures. Um, and best practices within the CNCF, and a tag may establish working groups to accomplish special projects or initiatives. And all of our meetings are public, and we look uh, for you to help contribute as well. So about runtime, right? Well, runtime is all about, in the name, runtime things. So workloads, scheduling, uh, batch work, um, and a lot of our scope is around those runtimes, obviously. Uh, orchestration, down to serverless and edge and IoT. Uh, AI is currently within the runtime scope, uh, along with uh, other tags. It's kind of cross-tag. Um, specialized OS and architecture, as well as virtualization um, and all types of sandboxing. So some of the sample projects within scope, a lot of names you're familiar with. Kubernetes itself is historically a runtime project, um, fairly mature these days. Um, but a quick shout out to our recent, three most recently um, uh, uh, projects that changed their level. So CubeEdge has graduated and Flatcar and Wasm Cloud as of three days ago are now in incubating. Uh, Runtime has three, uh, six working groups uh, across all types of interests. So if you have an interest in any of these areas, there's separate meetings, separate communities, separate leads. Uh, and so forth around AI, WebAssembly, OS, uh, all types of interest, all falling within runtime. And we do hold meetings uh, twice a month. Uh, these are our chairs and tech leads, and again, working with the TOC, so there's always a TOC liaison or, or relationship um, as a collaboration there. Uh, so please get involved. You know, we can, you can join runtime projects. Uh, we are look, always looking for more members to join our meetings. Uh, we have Slack channels or contributing to white papers and so forth. We're here at KubeCon. Uh, we are in the project pavilion uh, Wednesday through Friday. There's a tag runtime uh, booth there, so please come out. There's uh, some WebAssembly folks and AI folks and others um, to talk to there, as well as, you know, there's no way to go through all of the scope of that runtime uh, in just five minutes here. Please attend the maintainer track this Friday, 11 a.m., 
and we'll deep dive. Hope to see you there. Thank you.